time ago, especially when you see it like firsthand, you know? It's not like just something you see on the news, it's like your school. Students at Eagle Point High School are buzzing about the latest accusations towards an assistant coach sending inappropriate text messages and pictures to a student. I don't know, I just know that's not okay, like, at all. It should all be public and I believe that just, this should come to an end. But the school and the district are keeping tight-lipped on the investigation. And the stories we've been hearing was there was like pictures being sent and stuff like that, you know, more than just like a friendly, like how schools kind of thing. The alleged action took place a few weeks ago, but it wasn't reported to the Eagle Point Police Department until last Wednesday. In an email statement, Superintendent Cinda Rickert said the district isn't allowed to discuss personnel issues, but they are working closely with law enforcement. According to officials at the police department, the case has been transferred to another agency who will further look into the alleged allegations. What do we want? When do we want it? This past year has been rocky for Jackson County School District 9. Last May, teachers took to the picket line after 13 months of contract negotiations failed. They eventually reached an agreement. And earlier this month, the Eagle Point School Board voted in support of Superintendent Rickard, who was charged with knowingly replacing licensed staff with unlicensed staff in 2011. Rickard has adamantly denied all the charges. And the latest accusations are bringing the district back to the headlines. Giving our school a bad reputation. In Eagle Point, Kyle Averman, NBC5 News.